So you can see why I lined up all these churches on the far side of the forest, assuming they're white churches, which is probably pretty likely how we picture them. Probably we can't say that these were broad places where God would offer refuge to BIPOC people as a place of rescue through most of our history. There's a reason I said maybe being freed has to happen in spite of the church. I appreciate how Bishop Peter Story writes about all this. He speaks a strong prophetic call to the church to be the church in all the right ways. And he gives us four principles that I really, really appreciated. Telling the truth without fear, binding up the broken. Number three is live the alternative. Be the white congregation that's willing to be at that table. Live into that different kind of feel that we have kind of shied away from. And then lastly, join Jesus in the energy for change. And